Okay, it's the uh, first time I've been down here since the summer and uh, it's very windy and I um, haven't been metal detecting for a long time and uh, for obvious reasons and um, I thought I'd come down here and um, give it a bash uh, looking at the beach it's uh, changed uh, there's a lot of rocks so I don't know what I'm going to find and what I ain't going to find but um, we'll see and um, I'll let you know okay first hole right I'm going to dig everything no matter what bit of iron rubbish nail but, uh, there you go just going to dig everything and uh, see what I get part of the fun I suppose Blimey O'Reilly I've been here about four hours trying to dig this up ah, not really lobster pot and I'll give you a good signal though it comes off at about 70s so Gotta laugh, in ya. Haven't found much yet. Been here about an hour. Hard work in the winter. Don't seem to have much luck on this beach in the winter. In the summer, find loads. In the winter, I struggle. Never mind. Keep going. It's good exercise. Okay, halfway on my beach hunt. Um, from all rubbish, beer cans, stuff like that. Managed to uh, find a bin and bin it all. So um, I've got a big beach to go through as you can see. And I'm on the wet stuff and uh, I haven't really found anything. To anything on the I had a beautiful day and uh, you know, spring's coming. Looks like we're doing well with COVID. So uh, quite happy and um, I'm halfway to my destination, a couple of miles down there but um, I'm going to go down towards the sea edge and see if there's anything down there. I've been in the soft sand and um, it's very quiet but of course we've had no tourists, uh, we've had not a lot of people out and about losing stuff so don't really expect to find much but you know we'll see what happens let you know if we get anything decent. Okay, I haven't got a clue what that is, but um, I'm about in the middle of the beach, I would have said. Um, I don't know if that's something to do with a fisherman or a boat or part of the Second World War. Um, I'm not sure because we have got a lot of um, World War II bunkers up here on the beach and. Um, anti-tank walls and all sorts um, a lot of it's been removed obviously since the second world war but maybe that's left behind um, i'm not even going to dig it looks like it's big and rigid um, don't actually know what that is um, love to have known but hey some things you're just never going to find out never mind okay I was getting fed up of metal detecting. Not found anything all day. I was getting really like fed up. And then I come by the steps here, by the sea wall, and um, I got a hit. About a 62 or something like that. And I thought, ah, whatever. Probably a load of rubbish. And then I found the find of the day. I have got myself a half penny, I think they call it, with a ship on it. I can't quite get the date, but um, I can't wait to see what it is. And if that's all I find all day, I'm well happy. Lovely. <laughs> I'm so pleased. There's one for my collection, I'll tell you. That's going in my coin collection. That's the first one I've found. I see a lot of people in England pulling them up all the time, but I'll never get them. Not in Jersey here, and I've got one. I'm so chuffed. I think I better stay by the sea wall. Well, that's it for this beach hunt. Um, one good coin, which, or great coin that I'm happy with. 
lots of people just probably laugh about what sort of coin it is, but I don't really care. Um, the sun's coming out, and I'm against the seawall here, uh, the anti-tank walls. And I think I'm just going to sit here and enjoy this beautiful weather, which uh, made the most of it for half an hour. So, uh, look after yourselves, everyone, and uh, do your bit so we can get out of this COVID mess and um, see you all on the other side. Bye.